everything that we all own is just gone. Several local families will be spending New Year's looking for a place to live after this massive fire today. It erupted along Freeport Road in East Deer Township between Route 28 and the Terenum Bridge. Channel 11's Aaron Martin is live now after speaking with a man who fought to save his family from those flames. And Aaron, this is such a tough thing to go through, especially during the holidays. Yeah, that's right, Lisa. Absolutely unimaginable what this family is dealing with, and it could have even been a lot worse. But take a look. That is all that's left of this home right now. And if it wasn't for this father's quick thinking of getting the family to the back door as quickly as possible, they may have never gotten out. All Aaron Sicanti could do was comfort his fiance as they looked at what little is left of their home on Freeport Road. Everything that I own, everything that we all own is just gone. This morning around 1130, a pickup truck popped a tire and crashed into his front porch, puncturing the gas meter and creating a massive fire. Sicanti was resting after working the midnight shift when it happened. I come out the uh, bedroom after I heard the explosion. And I looked outside and I seen the truck was smashing our porch and the engulf in, engulfed in flames. He ran downstairs to get his fiance and their four kids all under the age of eight. He knew they only had seconds to get out of the house. It all happened probably within about 50, 55 seconds by the time the flames hit the dining room from the front porch. Smoke started to fill the downstairs, so they ran to the back door. It was me and my fiance. Uh, she's pregnant, by the way, and the four kids. And we got out to the back door and we had to bust out the window out the back door and we handed the kids over to the neighbor. She was trying to kick the door open so we could get out. Sicanti eventually got the door open and his family to safety. Moments later, firefighters arrived to the house engulfed in flames. What happened is an absolute tragedy, but yet also an act of God that we made it out alive. Now we have learned that the Red Cross is assisting the families that have been devastated by this fire, which is the good news. Again, nobody was hurt. However, we did learn that that family did lose two cats in this fire. Uh, as we mentioned, the Red Cross will be assisting those families with food as well as shelter as they continue to try to put their lives back together. We're live tonight in East Township. Aaron Martin, Channel 11 News.